Now, here's meteorologist TJ Del Santo with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. Well, we had an interesting afternoon with some rain and some snow showers coming on through. Even some reports of something called grapple coming out of the sky, like little styrofoam balls. Let's take a look at what's going on right now. Live pinpoint Doppler 12 radar showing. Uh, well, really uh, nothing going on the mainland of Rhode Island right now, but Block Island seeing some rain. We've got a little bit of light rain working off the coastline of Westport and Dartmouth. And we'll be seeing some more rain and snow showers during the night. Won't be amounting to all that much. So tonight, threat track low Monday low Tuesday we are looking at a medium threat of uh, some weather that uh, kind of slow things down for you a little bit that being some potentially heavy rain late in the day we'll talk about that in a second live pictures from downtown Providence we started the day with sunshine. We had lots of clouds. Now we've got the sun back for a little while. Should be a really nice sunset in a short time. Down in Narragansett, you can also see some clearing, kind of cool little stripes of uh, brightening in the sky there. Echo Lake, you can make out some of the snow. Look at the snowflakes falling up there in Pasco in the northwestern corner of the state. And that ended and a little bit of clearing uh, as well over the last uh, 30 minutes or so. Temperatures are in the upper 30s to around 40 degrees, so kind of chilly. 39 in Newport with a wind from the southeast five miles an hour. There's batch number one of showers and snow showers. Another batch will be coming on through a little bit later on in the night. It's all associated with a front that's put on the brakes temporarily and as a result we're seeing these little waves of moisture riding along them. It's going to be drifting on off to the south tonight and then it's going to come back northward uh, through the daytime tomorrow and this is actually good for us because it will kind of dry us out a little bit and we'll see a little bit of sunshine and we'll be warming up uh, as well with temperatures climbing through the 50s tomorrow. Let's take a look at it with our future cast. Here we are 8 o'clock this evening. Some rain showers still in the area, especially inland. Could be looking at some snow showers during the over night 6 o'clock Monday morning partly to mostly cloudy but dry dry for that morning commute into the afternoon there'll be lots of clouds but also some breaks of sunshine staying dry into tomorrow evening so for this evening a few showers some snow showers especially inland ditto for the overnight but all of it should be done by uh, morning and then for your Monday partly to mostly cloudy 55 degrees not too bad at all let's get a look at that live pinpoint Doppler 12 seven day future cast dry for Monday on Tuesday very changeable day. Temperatures will start out in the uh, mid to upper 40s, rise a little bit and then fall throughout the afternoon hours with a chance, a better chance of some rain during the afternoon hours on Tuesday. And again, some of that could be on the heavy side. Wednesday, more rain. Thursday, perhaps another dry day, but kind of chilly. Temperatures will only be topping out in the upper 40s on uh, Thursday and then Friday, maybe another all day rain. Saturday looks pretty mild, but we'll have the chance for showers through the day. Sunday right now looking dry about 57 degrees with a blend of clouds and sunshine. So look for more rain and snow showers tonight. Keep the snow shovels where they are, though. All right, TJ, thanks and happy Easter. Same to you. Thank you. Coming up, Eyewitness News at 630. The Red